What's up, everybody? We are back again with the modified version of five things to do this weekend. Of course, we are recommending five local eateries that you and your family can visit this weekend while you are social distancing. So let's just jump right into it. And we're gonna jump right on into it with the good stuff. Sweets, oh yeah. Jarrettsville Creamery and Deli. Listen, they have it all. They have sandwiches, they have hot things like soup, and if you're in the mood for that nice, delicious, sweet treat ice cream, they have lots of options for you to choose from. They open from like 10 to 8 each day. Good opportunities to do that this weekend, although the warmer day will be on Sunday. And if you're like me, you have been Netflixing and chilling by yourself or with your family if you are lucky enough to have family here. Uh, another opportunity to try out a local eatery, Pop Stations Popcorn Company. Check this out. They have all the flavors you need. They're offering curbside pickup. Great opportunities. For more information, check out our website. And it wouldn't be five things to do this weekend without an option that involved what? Pizza. Yes, pizza bowlies. Check this out. Not only do they have a lot of pizza options, but they also have subs, sandwiches, and pastas. And on top of that, they are located all across Maryland, and they're open with curbside pickup and contact-free delivery. And if you're tired of your mom's bad pork chops, because mine can't cook, or maybe you're just tired of eating the same old, same old. I got just what the doctor ordered. That's gonna be Baba's Mediterranean Kitchen. Check it out. Flavor to the max. And they're open all weekend. They have delivery options and they also have curbside pickup. For more info, check out our website. You have kids? Mention Katana to them. They're gonna say Mortal Kombat, mom. Mortal Kombat, dad. And that's because she throws fans or swords. I don't remember, but what you won't forget is Katana's Japanese cuisine and ramen noodles. Check this out. Have you been craving sushi? What? Yes, they have it. It's fresh. Japanese food in general, they have what you need. Just what the doctor ordered, curbside pickup and delivery options available. And if you're looking to get out this weekend and enjoy any of these famous local eateries, you'll have some good weather to do it in. Saturday will be a little bit chilly. It's gonna get into the mid to upper 50s but it's gonna be mainly sunny. As we turn the page to Sunday, we get the nicer numbers, we get into the 60s, but we're also gonna be tracking a chance of showers. The good news in all of this is all the wind that is taking a break right now, but I know you've heard throughout this entire recording, <laughs> it's not gonna be around, it's gonna be quieter. So a good day on Saturday to go out for that walk in the park. You will need to wear some sweats. It'll be a little bit more comfortable Sunday, but you will have to go with some rain. Of course, if you wanna keep up with the forecast for next week, you can always follow me at WXPatPete. And for more information on any of the things that we've listed today, you can head to our website, WMAR2news.com, under the community calendar. It's at the top of the page. It'll have you all the information that you needed there. And of course, we'll see you next week.